Yo, I, 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 go on. Look where I'm at. We back on extension, baby. You know what I'm saying? I ain't been on extension in a hot minute. I'm like, you know what? I need to hop back on here. So we've been leveling Deja here. She was level 35 not too long ago, but I've been leveling her. You know what I'm saying? Got the man Horan, you know what I mean? Although, uh, <clears throat> lore-wise, what I've created for this character, her having a dragon would be pretty backwards. It'd be like Raimundo or Jadam having an undead. It just makes zero sense for either one of them. For her to have dragons. Her and dragons, they don't get along. You know what I'm saying? But it looked cool, so I had to get one. I can't hit this dude because he's floating. I'm floating, sir. He said, but "Yeah, I've been messing around on um extension again, getting some characters leveled up, collecting some transmogs, making some gold and whatnot." My money was a little whack. So, I'm saying I've been chilling. I had to delete a few characters too because I had way too many random unknowns, unknowns, and I really only like to have characters who are my OG character since day one so I deleted a couple characters including the first character I ever made on this server I know it's kind of I know some people be like why would you do that man I don't know I just can't rock with the off-brand unknown unknown characters you know what I'm saying yeah, I, I need the OGs I need the OGs and she just wasn't an OG he was an OG Neverwinter character <laughs> what I did was I made a character I made on Neverwinter back in the day named Fela it was the dark it was the dark skin lady. Uh she's an OG Neverwinter character back when I used to play Neverwinter, but Warcraft, she's not a Warcraft character at all. I'm like, it started bothering me, you know what I'm saying? I have to be playing my OG, my real deal characters. My Jadams, my Dejas, my Raimundos, my J Rax, Tornies and all them. Navega, Govera, all them. You know what I'm saying? All my OG characters. I made all of them. Oops. I accidentally wasted my what's the name? We got our dragon here. You know what I'm saying? He's not the best for DPS, but he just look cool. I mean, look at him. Look at him. Uh, how can you not like this dragon? Boy, oh, on the, the homie about to die. If he about to die, that means I'm gonna be next. Hey, sir, can you uh, attack something? Oh, I don't have defensive on. I'm about to say, what, what are you doing, man? Standing around and crap. He, he's pretty. He's pretty good though. He's pretty strong. He's very consistent. May not be the best for DPS. I think the female dragons they're the best. They got Rain of Fire, uh, another Shadow uh, AOE, and a. They got three AOEs that they use constantly. So if you, if you want a dragon pet, you're gonna want to grab a lady dragon. Cause uh. They got a lot of AoEs. All three of their abilities are AoEs. <clears throat> Pretty dang healthy AoE, too. Hey, man! I can't attack nothing. Am I using cleave? I'm not using cleave. Why is my cleave not working? Where's my dag nabbing cleave, man? Yeah, I still got it. Wait. Oh. Hey. Oh, shoot. Whoops. Oh, forgot to learn it back, didn't I? Alright, now we got Cleave, but it's a little weak. Got a book. I got a book. Okay. I'm going to get this uh, lady to 70. I was messing around on Raimundo yesterday. <laughs> I was trying to collect a, uh, a Night Elf Ghost <laughs> as a pet. <laughs> to see like make it like a she got a like a freaking elf friend that fights with her and crap, but it, it, it didn't work It was like nah none of that I was gonna tame uh Ileana Rook or whatever the frick you say her name Raven Hook the freaking the boss in a uh, Dire Maul But that did not work Well, that was fast Let me pick man no, nope. all right. Uh, oh man. Okay, they normally get bags. Shit. What we got, man? Come on, man. Give me something popping. You feel me? Gabbage. Gabbage. What the fuck? It's the same crap I got on. <laughs> it's the same crap I'm wearing right now. 
I have no mana. See, he's good. Uh, he's good for the DPS though. Well, I like him. He does have a lot of AOEs that keep him pretty healthy. You know what I'm saying? Including the AOEs and stuff that I already got for myself. Now, Deja's build here is a. She's a. She's basically enhancement. It, let's, I'm gonna keep it on here. She's she's really pretty much enhancement. <laughs> she's a, an enhancement shaman that uses a little bit. That uses constant. I'm using concentration because uh, it's very good for DPS and it kind of matches the backstory. People don't. One thing people don't realize is I make a lot of backstories for these characters. I did at the time. I still kind of do actually. Not as much as I used to when I was younger. I'm saying that the, the, the kid's mind, the, the, you know, the imagination, it's crazy back in the day. So, the real reason the legendary clan exists has absolutely nothing to do with PvP and everything to do with the stories I used to make for these characters back when I was little. Um, the PvP is just what I turned it into because I ended up getting into PvP like crazy. Beforehand, it had absolutely nothing to do with PvP. And Deja was, so much like any of the other characters, supposed to be super powerful, mystical, freaking shaman. And I remember one time when I was little, I still remember the dream, it was crazy. <laughs> when I was little, she had some kind of ability that would blast her into the air and it would be like this freaking golden light every day where... And she just started killing a crap ton of dragons. She was, she was getting attacked by dragons. Which is why I say to, it's, her having dragons is kind of backwards. Be like Jada Marundo having an undead. The, the, the things you used to you, you would create when you were a kid, you know what I'm saying? The imaginative mind of a child. The crazy thing is, I still remember most of it. <laughs> but she was uh, she was getting attacked by dragons. And she was just she was just slaughtering dragons. But for, as a shaman, she didn't have electrical abilities and crap. It was like this goldish color. It wasn't like ho holy stuff, but it was like some kind of oh, I must say, uh, sorry, the tank ramp, but that is the tank. Did not realize at first. I don't even know what you would explain her powers were, but it was she was powerful. It was cool. It was cool. I was like, man, that was the coolest dream I ever had. And then that's when I started actually trying to level her so I could make her actually that powerful. Because at the time she was only like level 16. <laughs> I'm like, man, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta level her up now. It was in Red Ridge for some reason. No, there's not a single powerful dragon in Red Ridge. It was in Red Ridge. Um. So the build we're using, just just a uh, decent DPS build, ain't nothing special. But I now wanted a little dragon by her side. You know what I'm saying? I got a dragon for my Mundo now too. <laughs> I need to get Jadem leveled up. He is live and on the account, but he is level 1. I made him a while back and never actually did anything yet with him. Only downside with relying on mana is I'm out often. I need to turn this error text off. This crap is killing me. I can't do that yet. I can't do that yet. Shut your mouth, man. How you do that? There you go. Get out of here. So I'm like, I'm about to start messing around on this drone again. It's been a hot minute. Oh. I just ran right into that. I'm like, I ain't been on here in a hot minute. So I'm about to mess around. Might even record a dungeon. I did record a video already, but that was with the other character I didn't want anymore because she was a random. Not one of my legit OG characters, so I'm like, okay, let me dump this character off. And right, uh, Deja was sitting there, level freaking 35. I'm like, why am I leveling this dang character anyways? When I have a level 35 right there, and I'm leveling this character from level one, that ain't even an OG character. So the next character I do level will be Jadem, and then uh, probably uh, uh, Nelina. I want a character who's a super assassin, ambushing, backstabbing, 
try to get good at the PvP in this uh, on this server again. I used to be nasty back in the vanilla days, but it was a much different time. You know what I'm saying? I was crushing people in the vanilla days. Remember when I used to upload those PvP videos on this server? That was the last time I did it because uh, I tried PvP like a month or two ago. No, it's not a month, but for like five months ago, and uh, it didn't go well. I sat there uh, bullying this person. Only downside is there was no real bullying because I had no damage to offer. Okay, he just died. I have no mana. I need. I would say I need you to fight something, brother. I can get a heal. That'd be great. No, I'm about to say maybe one heal, two heals. That'd be cool. There's nothing back here, man. Go for it. Hey, damn it. I'm trying to use a dang cast. I ain't got no mana. My goodness. I was too close. Now I actually get to take this time to get my mana up, though. But yeah, I, I was I was attacking this dude, interrupting everything he did, stunning him in place. He tried to blink away. I blinked right behind him. Freaking blinding him, interrupting him, stunning him. I was doing everything you would do that would uh, 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 result in a person's death. And guess what happened? I died. Fast, too. It's like, how the fuck? There's no way the PvP could be that much different. And I know there's a, you know, you got your PvP power and your PvE power. Um, My PvP power was like 300 something. I'm like, maybe that's not the highest in the world, but at the same time, there's no way in the world that's that's low. My, my PvP power was like three, almost four hundred, and I was doing little to no damage to this man on a on a on a mobility crit build. So I got high mobility, high damage. Yet I was getting the complete opposite of high damage. So I'm like, okay, uh. PvP right now is feeling a little spammy. Reminds me of a server I used to play on back in the day that was absolutely horrible for PvP. The reason why I had uh, stopped PvPing on this. I'm like, shoot, maybe I could get him a rating. The rating is probably pretty fun. I'm probably gonna do that. <clears throat> but the, the PvP, I don't know. It was like a server I stopped playing a while back because of that. The server Sand Pyro was born on. <laughs> They, they were the gear, it was pretty much what I, what Legion was. I remember too when I was playing that server, I'm like, if Warcraft ever gets to this point, PvP is going to be pretty terrible. I was right and wrong. I was wrong because I didn't know Blizzard would make templates. I was right because world PvP where templates did not exist, it was exactly like that server. Anybody who had a little bit too much more health than you did, you would never see the daylights of killing them, and that is exactly how Legion was. There was so many poo butt PvPers during Legion, man. Oh my goodness. Especially on Moonguard. Get boosted through Arena a little bit. And then be on in, in, in Goldshire talking big trash. And as soon as BFA dropped, all those same people disappeared. I ain't seen them since then. I remember there was this torn warrior who would go around killing everybody. I was like, uh, one day, uh. My brother was like, we're about to get in a big old battle. So I'm like, oh shoot, send me an invite. Because I was on Jadam at the time. You know, Jadam was on a Dragon Blade and we were on Moonguard. That's where all that was happening at. Um, when we got on there, this was during BFA. This was when BFA dropped. This dude was so boo boo. I'm like, this is the nigga everybody was talking about? He was like, you know, Legion is a different uh, Legion. He was better in Legion, but he wasn't better in Legion. The problem is Legion was so freaking spammy. Legion was spammy in world PvP. If anybody had slightly better gear than you, you can guarantee you weren't gonna kill them. If if you were playing a rogue and you had uh, 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 what like seven million health and you were fighting a rogue with nine million, you killing him? Psh, good luck. Good freaking. Yeah, that's a nice sword, but. I don't think I'll ever be able to get rid of this pacifier not until they give me something for level 40. The fuck, man, with all these 
Mm-hmm. All these low-level dang weapons, dude, man. Why do you keep giving me the same stuff, too? Come on, bro. I'm about to buy a weapon. Stuff on this server, man. Cheap if you didn't know. And if you never played over here before. I'm saying items are... Ooh, I got a katana. Is that a katana? That's not a katana. Dang, never... Uh, Mundo needs a katana. Raimundo only uses katanas, man. Okay. But yeah, uh... It was it was a spammy mess, and I know there's a lot of people. Oh, I wasn't that bad. Get the fuck out of here! You clearly never world PVP because world PVP was awful during Legion. It let the doodlest people be the best, because all you needed to do was have some freaking losers run you through uh, heroic and Taurus, or whatever the frick the last raid was, and or uh, some dang uh, arenas, and you would have unstoppable damage and health exactly like that private server was which is why i stopped playing on it because um i forgot what the heck the server was called it's been so long but sam pyro i was a character i had made on that private server when i had first started playing it and she kind of just stuck because i thought she was a really cool character um i remember i was at the gurubashi arena watching people fight and i forgot what the heck happened but somehow somebody killed me so when i tried to fight him he was literally standing there doing nothing and turned around and practically instant killed me then had the nerve to trash talk after i'm like man i dare you to pull that same thing off on retail he said he said something something retail who even plays retail i'm like is that a serious question <laughs> this was during cataclysm so there was uh, uh, a lot of people playing i'm like is that a serious question please tell me you're joking because Nigga, everybody named Mama on retail right now. <laughs> so, I was like, I guarantee you can't pull that off on retail. I guarantee you can't. And then I, I you know, I started, I started getting into that ruthless trash talk, and of course he got mad. See you around. And he was like, whatever, and put me on ignore. I'm like, yeah, that's what I thought. This server's. I said this. I said this PVP ain't legit. This PVP ain't legit by the slightest. You could never pull that off on retail. He just stood there doing nothing. I'm like, yeah, exactly. Don't ever. I ain't gonna lie, I got, I, I got disrespected. Disrespected the crap out of me. I got upset. I ain't gonna, <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I, got, I was upset. I'm like, no, this. Okay, I understand you killed me. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I didn't really understand this server like that. I was, I was pretty new. I thought my gear was kind of decent. And, 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 and shoot, how much health did you have? I think I had like, dang, uh, it was something stupid. But it was it was it was absurd numbers like Legion. Legion where people had freaking 10, 11 million health. And, and uh, I'm pretty sure we had more than that, of course. But it, it was at that it was Legion was at a light spot of that. And it, it made the P world PvP pretty bunk. Uh, BGs? Wasn't too bad. Um, especially on the Arms Warrior. The Arms Warrior, I don't know what the frick was up with the Arms Warrior. When I had f freshly got Raimundo to level... Uh, what was it? 110? Her item level was 804. And just in case people don't remember, 804 is terrible. Absolutely abysmal. That is... I literally just hit 110. <laughs> that is what an 804 gear score is. I had a couple of 860 pieces in my bag. I slapped them on and it it, it launched me up to a eight from a I, I oh yeah I still remember a 798 from 109. When I put the pieces of gear on at 110, I went up to 804. That's that's how that's how uh, busted the Arms Warrior was in Legion. So I, I can't I can't front about the actual in-game PvP. It was the world PvP that was pretty terrible. The world PvP was... Ooh, and all them same people that were super killers during, um, Legion were straight garbage when BFA dropped. I'm like, dang, this is what, this is, this is the, what Legion has built. These boys, boo-boo. <laughs> Anyways, man. Is probably not how this is. And I just didn't know what the fuck I was doing. So I'm, I'll probably make a character where I figure out the PvP. But I mean, shoot, I don't mind some good old PvE, you know what I'm saying? That, that, I think that'll be a lot of fun getting into raids and whatnot. 
Plus, they bought the, I think they just dropped Zulaman, so... I don't know. We might, we might find out. Anyways, let me stop talking, man. This has been your boy, Jeton Legion Teddy. If you enjoyed this video, it's good. If you didn't enjoy this video, it's good. Either way, if you watched it, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, man. Alright, I'm out of here.